My name is Allison Haynes and I graduated from Lander University in December 2013. I received my degree in elementary education and I was also a teaching fellow. I'm here to tell you about life after Lander and how teaching fellows impacted me as a future educator. After graduation, I got a long-term sub position at 96 Primary School in the Media Center. I really, really loved it and I considered going back to school to get my master's degree in library science. After about a month being in the library, the principal and assistant superintendent came to me and said, we need you to go to eighth grade, we can't find anybody. So, since February, I've been teaching eighth grade language arts at Edgewood Middle School in 96. Teaching eighth grade has been one of the most interesting experiences I've ever had. Since I was an elementary major, I was only expecting to teach second through sixth grade. After student teaching in the fall, I found my heart was in second grade, so that's what I was used to. And then out of nowhere, I got moved to eighth grade. And it's kind of really weird for me because these kids are as big as me, if not bigger. My classes at Lander and being a teaching fellow has taught me many things that I've learned to apply to my everyday life as a teacher. First of all, I've learned how to be flexible, and when you feel unprepared, you have to act as if you're prepared. Classroom management is also a must. It determines the success of your students and your classroom as a whole. Life after college doesn't necessarily have more responsibilities, but just different types. It's not just about you anymore. The only thing you had to worry about in college was getting up and going to class, and if you didn't feel like going, you just didn't go. But now, you have to go to work, and more people depend on you, such as the other teachers at school and the students. It's kind of like parenting. You're not just worried about yourself anymore, you have to think about your kids. Everybody's had a teacher that's inspired them, so my advice to you is be the teacher that inspires. If it doesn't go as planned today, just try again tomorrow. Good luck in all of your future endeavors.